Welcome to this CUBE conversation. I'm Lisa Martin. This conversation is part of our third AWS startup showcase for this year. I'm pleased to welcome Knox Anderson, the VP of product management at Cystic. Knox, welcome to the program. Thanks for having me, Lisa. Talk to me a little bit about Cystic, secure DevOps for containers, Kubernetes and cloud. Give the audience an overview of what you guys do. Uh, so Cystic is a secure DevOps platform that provides observability, security, and compliance functions for anyone that's adopting Kubernetes and cloud. Um, we really secure the entire lifecycle from source to production. So do things like scan your IAC for misconfiguration, monitor, monitor your runtime environments for threats and uh, operational best practices. Uh, we provide a lot of capabilities around Prometheus monitoring as well. Uh, and then also let organizations perform incident response and compliance audits against these, against these environments. So founded in 2013, talk to me about the gap in the market that you guys saw back then and what some of the key challenges are that you solve for your customers. Yeah, so um, we came to market around the same time as containers and Kubernetes. Uh, and I'd say 2015 to 2018, we kept on saying it's the year of Kubernetes, it's the year of Kubernetes, it's the year of Kubernetes. and then. Uh, really during uh, the last year and a half in the COVID pandemic, uh, Kubernetes has gone gangbusters. Um, every major cloud is seeing a huge adoption in their Kubernetes services. And so that's really our wedge into a lot of organizations. Uh, they're changing their platform to take advantages of containers and Kubernetes. And you really have to rethink all of your security tooling. And that's when a company like Cystic comes in. Talk to me about customers in terms of, especially in the last year and a half when things have been so dynamic, we've seen so much too on the threat landscape front changing. Uh, give me an example of a customer or two that you really helped with solve some of their major challenges here. Yeah, a, a great customer um, that we work with is SAP Concur and they kind of uh, encompass a lot of the things that are uh, nice about modern DevOps. So. It's a DevOps team that's uh, running a Kubernetes platform that thousands of developers are building their apps and deploying those onto. And they chose Cystic because uh, really it's not scalable to have every single dev team ping that DevOps team and say, what's the performance of my service? Um, how is it responding? Um, how can I get scanning integrated with that? And so they use Cystic as a platform that allows um, developers to easily onboard onto uh, their Kubernetes clusters, and then ensure that they're meeting uh, compliance needs and FedRAMP needs uh, for that platform that they deliver their core business apps on. Let's talk about the Cystic's commitment to open source and the Falco project. Uh, so Falco is a open source project that we started at Cystic. Um, it's built on top of our core uh, system call instrumentation. And so Falco uh, meets a lot of your IDS or your file integrity monitoring requirements uh, that you might have as you move to Kubernetes. Uh, and, and really it's something uh, we started about 2016. Uh, in 2019, we donated that project to the CNCF, uh, which is the same governance body behind Kubernetes, Prometheus, and other uh, kind of core building blocks of the cloud native ecosystem. Um, since then, it's uh, grown uh, immensely. Um, companies like uh, Shopify are using it to make sure that uh, their PCI apps that they run Kubernetes are uh, fully compliant. And so uh, it's something that we are constantly contributing to. Um, the community also from uh, even companies like AWS uh, is a core contributor to this to, to the Falco project. Um, and I'm really excited to see where it goes over the next year as uh, Falco extends to also cover some cloud security use cases. What can you tell me about the relationship that Sysdig and AWS have? Uh, they've been a great partner. Um, we internally run our SaaS uh, on AWS. So um, we're using AWS services to deliver our uh, product um, to our customers. Uh, and then we've also, really worked closely around uh, how you can provide better uh, security for services like Fargate. Um, so we did working sessions with their engineering teams, uh, learned what we could do to get the visibility that we need for tools like Falco and Cystic uh, to work seamlessly in Fargate environments. Uh, and um, last April, we're able to kind of AWS release that new functionality, Cystic built on top of that and have already seen great adoption um, of customers using the Cystic product on top of Fargate. 
Excellent. Well, thank you so much, Knox, for stopping by the queue, telling us about Cystic, what you guys are doing ahead of the AWS Startup Showcase. We appreciate your time and your information. Thanks for having me. For Knox Anderson, I'm Lisa Martin. You're watching this CUBE Conversation.